All right, we're here with Vapor Trails. Uh, I don't know, I just came across it on Steam. And it looks like a platformer, side-scrolling kind of thing. Maybe Metroidvania-like, sprawler kind of game. I like those. So, nothing but the algorithm this time. Let's see what we got. New game. We're just jumping right into this. Okay. Alright, so single jump. I can punch stuff. I can kick stuff. Okay. That's kind of cool. You got a little combo system. And so far, none of the other buttons do anything. Oh. So I can slide down walls, but I can't jump off them yet. I suspect that will be like an unlockable ability. Kick. Alright, so it looks like the kick is just kick. I've got like a little three hit combo I can do. I have to imagine that you'll unlock more attacks, but... Oh. Okay, whatever that is. There's like a little overhand chop, I like that. So, so far I like the animation, it's very fluid. It's got a nice atmosphere to it. And the... I know it sounds like a small thing for me to get caught up on, but the jump feels like it has the right weight, if that makes sense. The arc on it feels right. It doesn't feel like it floats too much. You don't feel like you have rocks in your pants or something where you're dropping too quick. Oh! Afterburner. Once the deeps were drained of oil and stabilized, the need arose for flight through the empty undersea caverns. Ionize a reserve of plasma along wings and launch it backwards. Okay. I feel like the thing on my back is new. Are those the wings? Tab for inventory. There we go. Ionize a reserve of plasma on long wings and launch it backwards. Oh! Hello! I have a dash move now. Okay. I don't really understand the instructions on there. I'm using a controller and I feel like it's giving me instructions off of the keyboard. But I'm going to assume that's Afterburner. And you can do that in the air. Very cool. Okay. Hmm. I may have been defeated by, uh, by this particular section here. All right. So if I jump there, no. But if I'm going up a ramp and I jump, I get better height. Hmm. Alright, so I'm doing something wrong there. I just don't quite know what yet. But that also means I should at the apex of... Ah, uh, there we go. Alright, see you around, I guess. So that's interesting. It's... Whoa! It's important as to whether or not you're on a ramp. That actually makes a difference for your jump. 
if you're going up on an incline. That's legitimately kind of cool. <laughs> Twice in a row. So this looks like... Oh, man. There you go. So it takes a bit of finesse, but it works. You just have to get used to it. Is that one smoking a cigarette? Okay. Hey. Howdy. <laughs> Hello. Why do you talk? <laughs> I got some emulated neurons too, kid. <laughs> I need to get to the surface. <laughs> yeah, you do. I'd help you out. But I'm currently on a smoke break. What? Break from what? <laughs> Everything, really. Okay. Game's got jokes. I... The number of enemies that just run from you. Alright. You can use the right analog to get some idea of your surroundings, which I do really appreciate in this type of a game. Sorry, what now? Boost slide. Boost slide. Left shift. Okay. So I'm going to bet from what I've seen so far this game's going to be far more about traversal than combat, which is not a complaint. But it doesn't mean you'll have to get good about uh, how to jump up areas like that. There you go, just like that. Tunnels Greg, huh? A visitor, hello. I supposed I had dreamt you. I've been dreaming a dream of the deeps for years. A dream, a deep dream indeed. You're a prismatic too. I don't know what prismatics are. This game did not give me any context of story, which I realize the hilarity of complaining about that since I usually skip them. Oh dear lord! How embarrassing. You're a strong one. Yes, she is. Okay. Autonav. When the first tunnels were dug, the machines relied on onboard sensors. Soon after, Super Strata communication rendered these sensor packages obsolete. Okay. Does that mean I now have a map? Yes. Okay. That would absolutely come in handy on an area like this. Oh, I get to climb up tunnels gray. Cool. Okay. Fine. I mean, it's not like it bounces you or anything. No, it did nothing for me. I can always go down this way, I guess. That looks poisonous. Oh, good. Smoking dude. What is this place? An abscess sludge temple, but who left the med? Things get kind of weird around lots of prismatic bikes. I don't know what's going on, but it's interesting, though. He's got a nice little sense of humor with that dude. And with uh, Tunnel's Greg almost falling on the face. Attack form game. Dive kick. Air only. Okay. Again, very slick animations for him. I like it. I 
can't tell if I'm supposed to like bounce off of that. If I try holding the button. Nope. Dive kick onto Ah, there we are. Okay, we got dive kick on there. Okay. Scanning for updates. Shrine unlocked. Save points. Shrine hack. I just got an achievement in the bottom corner. This is a demo. Do demos give achievements now? Okay. Whatever. Don't knock it. That could become really tough, but also kind of rewarding. And stuff like that. I dig that kind of stuff in these games. That's cool. I'm gonna come through the wall there. Out of curiosity. Nope, you can't break those. You just slide on them. Oh no. Oh, Deal. Oh, alright. So I'm a little sloppy there. No! Very sloppy there. No! Oh, overshooting. Let's try this. Oh my goodness. There is some slidiness. Oh no. Heal. I am running out of heal. Alright. Not enough. No! Oh, I was doing so well. No! Oh, really? You, you put me back there. There we go. We we made it. We we made it happen. All right. I'm assuming that will increase my life bar. Is that the only reason I came this way? No. Nope. Oh, now I gotta get out of this place. That is legitimately cool. When you pull that off, you, you feel some skill. Alright. Why are those big thorns down here? Are they near the lake? You should ask them about it. Okay. I could get into this game. It feels like a slower pace, which is not a complaint. West, Sludge Waste, I'm already lost. Um, but this has a cool vibe going for it. I feel like I'm unlocking new abilities at a decent clip, so I feel like there's something new around the corner. Obviously, that can't last. I'm not going to be getting new abilities every five minutes for the rest of the game, but it's keeping the, the opening of this fresh anyway, which is nice. But so far... I would give this sprawler a chance. This is got a nice clean aesthetic. It's definitely got a... Oh, there you go. I did it. It's definitely got a level of skill required for the traversal, but I'm okay with that. That's kind of refreshing, to be honest. There we go. Yeah, like that kind of stuff makes you feel like a badass. That's cool. Oh, I think we found somebody who can fight back. He has arms. Okay. Oh! Dude! I mean, he could fight back. <laughs> and I clobbered him. Okay. No! So she's a little slidey. That's okay. What the heck is that? How in the word? Okay. I was certain I got that. There we go. 
I know I hit it. Alright, so it does nothing. Yeah, there's far more challenge so far in the traversal than there is in the combat, but I think that person has a harpoon gun. Yes, they do. That was your warning. Okay. Trying to get to the surface. A sludge smoking... A cigarette. Said the only way was through deep town. Okay. Okay. Okay, just calm yourself. I'm not gonna pick a fight with you just yet. Oh, look who it is. Hey, come with me. I gotta show you something. Sure. Don't worry about where we are for now. I realize I need to teach you how to break your falls. Try dashing right before you bounce off the wall or the ground. It can be five times, and I will. Okay. Left shift. Alright, so... I'm currently using a PlayStation 4 DualSense or whatever it's called. I don't know. PS4 controller. So, developer of the game. So far, I really dig your game. I think it's good. I enjoy it. I strongly encourage it to recognize additional controls. So that, for example, if it says, Hey, this game will work great with your Xbox controller or your PlayStation controller. That the on-screen commands match the controller that's being used. Because I don't know what left shift is. Uh, <sighs> left shift, dash, R2. Cool. Alright, so... What does he want me to do? And dash before you hit the ground. Okay. Miss. Oh. -ho! Now, another thing I would suggest, if there's something involving timing, it doesn't hurt to have a character show you doing it with the right timing uh, versus me just trying to do it. Because right before you hit the ground... I thought it was like instant, like a couple of frames before, whereas in reality I'm hitting it maybe half a second before I hit the ground. Um, just little things, right? But still, very cool. I'll take us back now. Oh! Well, if there was ever a moment to end on, Val versus Smoke Beast, and it looks wild. Oh, you missed me, Smoke Beast. Ow. Oh. That. Holy crap, he's got way more hit points than me. Woo. I cannot get a second. Away from me. Alright, we're just gonna have to beat the hell out of you. You're not gonna let me heal. I think it means I lost. All right. I like the smoke coming out of his ribs. That's a nice touch. That's pretty good. Dude, 
Dude, yeah. destroyed you. That beast can smoke. Steven wasn't lying. Okay. And I got whatever that item was. That was kind of cool. You. I hope you liked my little Ukemi lesson. Yeah, thanks. So I think that's about all I'm going to do on this game for now. But this has potential. I like this. This is cool. And I am partial to this type of game. Like the Metroidvania sprawler or whatever you want to call it. I like this style of game. And when it's done well especially. And when it's unique. And this looks unique. Uh, so I'll be keeping an eye on this. Anyway, next time.